Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Resident Rice 4. Let's try that again. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Resident Rise 4. Alright, as you may see, there is a bit of a difference going on in our base. And that's because Doge was recording the last episodes and he forgot to turn the mic on. So yeah, that's our new Doge. But I'll give you a quick tour. So all that footage was no sound. So yeah, nice. Good, always professional around here. Anyway, so what do we do? We got a load of purple slime, which we found, where is it? There is an island that way. I'm pretty sure we marked it on our map. It's, uh, yeah, there it is. That one, I think. So we went and got a load of purple blocks and then you you smelt them with iron and something else. Sand? Gravel? I don't know. So you get purple slime. I'll um I'll find out what it is and I'll tell you. We made a leadstone jetpack, I don't know if we had already, but we also made an induction smelter. I I haven't actually been able to get it working. So that's how you make it, and uh, it's quite easy to do actually, but I thought you could put stuff in and it would work like a proper furnace, but I'll have to look into that. We also made an alloy smelter, and that's because you need that, uh, and you put, so you put iron with nickel, which I've used them all up now, and you get invar. Ninva is what we need to make our next jetpack upgrade. But also we put some glowstone to make it look a bit nice and light it up. Uh, we've made this little item, um, just trash, whatever. You just throw your stuff in and it'll get rid of it. And what else? We got some blood because we, up we upgraded this a bit and made it bigger. We'll close all that up so that looks a bit nicer well it's got more room and we've still got a fuck ton of purple slime because this is our purple slime situation got loads of it we we got what else we got loads of night slime so now we can upgrade our tools with night slime another thing which I'm really upset about is we went out and we found a mining, um, a little mining place, you know, the tunnels, mining tunnels. And we got killed by another bloody Zulu queen. It's horrible. But, yeah, that's mostly what we've done. We did a little bit of exploring around. Um, if I remember anything else that we did then I'll, I'll tell you, but unfortunately all that footage is unusable. But we do want to make an upgrade for our jetpack, which is here. We need Invar. Invar? And that's gonna, this jetpack is okay, but it runs out of fuel really fast and it's a bit slow. As you can see, it's like, you know, mediocre. Doge isn't too impressed. Um, I'm trying to think if we did any more with electricity. Still got our pulverizers. Got alloy smelter. This is energetic infuser. I don't know if we had it last time as well. This is what you use to charge up your your jetpack. So you run out, get that, put that in there, and it charges it up. Grand very nice oh yeah and we got a mining backpack in the the little mining shaft thing and all you all this is for is you can put ores in there it only carry, carries ores like redstone all that stuff anyway onwards and upwards hopefully fuck off moth sorry there's a moth in my room i'm gonna have to deal with this Oh, yeah. 
dead. Anyway, All right, let's make a upgrade to our jetpack and then we can go and explore. That would be nice. So first of all, let's find jetpack. Also, I did an update to this, um, to, to Resonant Rise 4. There was a new update and I added some stuff. Now I'm still playing on the same map, so I don't know if that stuff will get implemented uh, on newly generated um, map portions, but hopefully it will. It's just stuff like uh, buildings. I also got one for better FPS and frames and all that. Those two are the same things, but you know, performance overall. Okay, so right, let's get started with this. So what do we need? That one. So we want the hardened jetpack, which goes after the leadstone. So we need two hardened thrusters. Oh yeah. Okay, so we need two reactant dynamos. Four lead gears. Okay, let's do that. This will probably be kind of speed it up a bit because it's kind of boring. Look at how much more juice that holds. Let's charge them up. And now we play the waiting game. You know what? I'm actually going to make some Invar armor because we need protection. Is that any good though? Let's have a look. think so I don't know let's see yeah maybe possibly probably not okay now to upgrade our tool so if you have an existing tool already made and you want to upgrade it to another thing so I want the unnatural uh, thing on this you just whack it in and it'll have, it'll replace it with cold-blooded, because that's manilium, with a natural. Simple as, bosh. All right, so we're kitted out. We got our jetpack with a lot more juice. And we got a mining bag, a bit of food. We need more food. Take some of that. Don't need the slimy, slimy slime. Okay, let's have a look of what's out there. Give me that. Oh yeah, we found a load more of these. Someone just blow up. Yeah, look at our fuel now. It's a lot better and we're faster. Okay, so the ravine. That's what we found last time. you can see this is a very beautiful landscape and there it is the ravine I don't know why the markers are up there so 
let's see what we can farm up in here. Oh, Cyclops. Okay, let's get mining. We've been out on a mining expedition on the ravine. And we got a lot of goodies. All right, let's get home and I'll show you all the goodies. I don't think there's any point showing me, showing you all of the mining because uh, I've done a lot of that content before. Okay. All right, guys, this is the loot. But wait, there is more. And that. Uh, quite happy with all the loot we got. Hey. All right, let's put everything away. Okay, so what we're actually going to do here is just cut all this away because we need, we're getting too much ore and we need the back of this furnace, this smeltery, so that we can uh, utilize more, more of these. So let's get into it. Smelted all our ores. Fuck, that took ages. We got loads of stuff. So that should be enough to build lots of machines. Oh, and um, I've also upgraded this a bit, made it look a bit nice. The walls, these walls, I'll do those eventually. And these, I missed this out. So I'll do that now. There we go. We should probably charge our jetpack. Doge. We should take Doge out on a mission. Okay, I think we're also going to do a slight upgrade to our weapon because we want to. Have we? Yes. Alright, so we need. Nanda Pearl and Blaze Powder to make an Iron Vendor. And now we need two Glowstone. I think. Yes, that's what we want. So, how do we do this? Put that in there. No idea. Like that. Glowing. Yeah, so now we, this gives us light. Oh, you don't have your jetpack. So, what does this actually do? Oh, it is glowing. Yeah, it gives you light. Cool. Oh, not the cat again. Hello, friend. Global. Oh. Oh, my weapon leaves globals. That is amazing. And they stay there forever? Oh, this is great. Never will we have to light the path again. Nice. Okay. Let's get all our berries. Okay, and I think that's going to be it for this um, episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I enjoyed playing mining a lot. And um, I'll see you on the next one.